For many years, I've been cleaning my ears with Q-tips. I'm sure you could relate, but today there's really cool technology that not only allows you to clean your ears more effectively, but also see what's going on. And today we're gonna demonstrate it to you so you could see what it's like, what's included, and more in this video coming right up. Hi, welcome to SIDS Tips and thank you so much for joining me as we talk about a more effective way to not only see what's going on in your ears, your kids' ears, and even your pet ears using a device with a camera and your smartphone. How cool is that? Now, the company Axel Glade sent me their product. This is called the Spade. And even though they sent it to me, and when you see it in action, I think you'll say it's pretty cool. Uh, then you can go to the website and order it. And if you have any questions, you can put those in the comments below. I'll try and answer those for you. But a lot of reviews out there, I, people really seem to like the product. And for me, and I think in this video, it will really be of help to you. So let's go ahead first talk about what's included. Obviously, you've got the box, got some good information on the back of the box here. Uh, we've got a really good instruction sheet, how to set it up. With it. They have an app that ties in with their camera and the device. Then you've got these alcohol swabs for cleaning the camera. You've got these, which these are kind of nice. These are like feather for massaging your ears. Kind of very, very cool there. You have your type C. I've got a number of cables, but it does have a type C cable. And then you have these additional parts. You have like these, what they call Q-tips. And by the way, these are all reusable, which is cool because you can wash it off with soapy water or alcohol pads. Uh, let's see, they have mentioned soapy water, alcohol, or alcohol wipes. So, which is, uh, that's good. So you can reuse them and then you've got like a soft material. So they've got that there. And then you have the device with the camera and then these tips can be adjusted. Now what's also cool in the base, which is the charging base, this is where it powers up. Uh, and we'll talk about that in a minute. There are additional tips. So there you go. So you got what these look like the Q-tips and they have these others that can use for depending upon what you wanna do for cleaning your ear. Now what they, call these different tips and I need to use my my glasses oh boy my vision is getting worse so we've got the uh, Q elastic ear pick and that is the world's first PC and silicone gel alloy we've got the D pick so these different picks and then this one here the round one is the annular ear pick to dig out wax stuck in outlines of ear of the ear and then you have the cotton swabs and that's to clean the ear with and again any of these can be reused uh, and you just need to clean them with soapy water alcohol as i mentioned so that's really cool that they're right in here and they're easy to change out so let me uh, show you now now this is also the unit that or the charging station where the unit sits like this, and this is where it charges. Now it takes about 90 minutes of charging, and on the device, when I show you that in a minute on my phone, it will show you how much battery life is. But this ring will light up green when it's charging, and it turns blue when it's done. And when it's pretty much done with the battery life, it will turn red. So you have the red for when the battery really needs a new charge. It mentions here, uh, red is low to no power, green is charging, and the blue light is charged. So those are the three different options. All right, now let's go ahead and let me get my phone to show you. Uh, actually, I'm gonna demonstrate here, which I did when I set it up, uh, and this is how easy it is to set up, and then we'll go ahead live into my phone and I'll demonstrate it to you. So here is the setup. Okay, so we're going to turn on the app. We're going to hit the QR code. We're going to browse the site. We're going to go ahead and install. And open the app and turn on your device. So we'll go ahead. And we're going to go ahead and turn on the device while using the app. We'll allow that. And now we're going to 
gonna connect. There it is, spade. And it is, click on spade, and it looks like it's now connected. And there, let's make sure. Tap to connect, yes. Let's go back into the app. So it looks like it's connected, it's showing it's got 73% remaining battery, remaining time. And let's see. Pick left here. The picture's unclear, please use an alcohol swab. I got it. You can see that was very easy. You just follow the steps. And right here on this uh, booklet sheet, they have the QR code and then you're good to go. All right, now, once we have that up and running, we'll go ahead and what you need to do is have the camera take that off and you can see it lights up, which is cool. And now we're gonna go ahead and now that I've got the camera open and it's on, what we're first going to do is we're gonna go into Wi-Fi and we are going to look for the camera, which should come up in the selection. You can see there it's the second one. We're gonna click Spade. It's now connected, and now we're gonna go ahead and go into the Spade app. Now, it usually does do a pop-up to let me know. There you go, it has no internet access, so I just swipe up on that. Now, I'm using an Android phone, so it may be a little different on, the, on your iPhone or if you use this with your iPad, whatever it might be, but there's the Spade app, and there we go. Now, you could see there, remaining time is 85 minutes and remaining battery life is 95% remaining battery. So as far as it can do two things, it can do photos and it can do videos. For photos, it's three megapixel. For video, it's 30 frames per second. So the way we go in, uh, actually you'll see there, so you got the homepage, the album, uh, and I'll show you, these are ones that I've taken, uh, videos and photos, then you've got help, and then the personal, Center. So there's some other stuff. I haven't used the personal center. So now the way to get into the camera, you're going to press into that, uh, which I, let me go back and just show you again, the, the Wi-Fi. I'm going to click on that. And now you can see how quickly it takes me right into the camera. And now you can see the camera here as I'm turning this, you can see real time. Now uh, here on the left bottom, uh, that is shifting it so we can have it upright, you can adjust it if you want to go vertical or horizontal. Then the next one is the ear. So you have your right ear or your left ear. You've got a photo where you can take a photo, a video, and then you could see your album there. So now let's go ahead back in, which I knocked myself out. And now we're going to go ahead and do the right ear. Are you ready? We're going in. Here we go. Let's see what we got going on in my ear. How cool is this? So now we are in my ear again. This is something to think about with your kids. And I've got a very hairy ear canal. And so you could see, and we'll talk about changing the heads, how easy that is, but there you go. That is the camera. Now, if I want, I could take a photo. So that was the photo. And then if I want to take a video, I press the video button and there we go. Me moving around and then I could stop the video by pressing that button. Now I'm going to move the camera out. And there was that latest photo that I took. Now you could delete it or you could share that. And then for videos, this was the latest video that I just took. So it's very cool. Now we're going to go back to the home. And then if you want, you could then do the same thing in your left ear. And we can see what's going on my left ear. Oh, I got something in there. And then you could use this tool that I have to remove. So you could see how cool that is, uh, what is going on inside your ear. Now, the other thing too is you can adjust. They've got a wide lens and then they've got a focus lens. Let's actually look at that real quick. So that is a focus lens. And now let's go with the wide lens. So you could see the difference there. And then the focus, it looks like it gets in a little bit closer. I don't see a big difference, but a little bit. You can see how it zooms in a little bit. So very, very cool. Now, let me go ahead and share with you how you could change the tips. So this 
has a metal piece that you could turn like this. And then the ring, it's got a ring there. That ring you could put down and then you could take the ear tip out. And so if I want, and I want to use one of the Q-tips, I could then just put that right on the camera like this. And now it's on. Then what I do is take the ring. Whoop. I just drop the tip. So again, I am trying to get that in there. Practice makes perfect. That goes like that. Take the ring. And that's it. And then what I can do. Now let's see if I take the Q-tip. I can come in here and clean my ear. And that's just a great alternative to using Q-tips and much safer for your ear canal. So then what, once you're done using it, you could rinse it off again with soapy water. You can use alcohol swab, whatever it might be. And then this is one of the heads again that you can use. And you have the option of the different heads here depending upon what you want to use it for. Uh, so they give you all nice options to choose from. So there you go. Very, very cool product. You could save the photos. You could save the videos and reuse them. And when you are done, just put the cap on. It is a magnetic cap. And then that sits in there like that and you are done. So there you go. Let me know what you think. I think this is really cool. It's a definitely smarter way that you can clean your ears, your kids' ears, and your pet ears, see what's going on, much healthier, much safer, and it's so cool with technology what you can do. All right, everybody, let me know if you have any questions. I love it, really, really cool, and I hope this video has helped you. If you have been seeing you know, some advertisements or other videos about it and curious what it's all about, well, there you go. Hope my videos have helped and leave any comments below for any questions and also uh, how the experience is for you. I appreciate your time. Thanks so much and happy ear cleaning. Take care.